Who knew that doing some puns would leave me with a t- with a ten day ban from Football Manager? Unbelievable! Hello, folks. Welcome back. Let's get into the Arsenal save, which is continuing now. All right, then it's uh, it's me. Yes, there was a short leave of absence. Um, I'll just say really briefly. I was just going through a rough time and. I'll just leave it at that because I could get I could go into detail, um, but if you saw me on Twitter, you'll know what happened. If not, then don't worry about it. And for anyone that leaves the comment, what happened? I just felt I just felt run down. I just felt a bit low, and now I feel better. So here we go. Christmas is coming to town, isn't it? Although, rarely do you then go to town to see if Christmas is actually there. You stay at home because it's warmer. Now, much like me, you'll probably need to refresh yourselves on what happened last time we met. It was actually the game against Espanyol. It was a 3-2 win, and we take that lead into the second leg today. Uh, since then, we did beat Watford. It was a 3-1 win, and Moussa Dembele got himself a hat-trick. Hopefully, you are still familiar with what happened. If not, go watch last episode. Come back and, and know what's going on, which is what I just did. <laughs> so we've got Espanyol today, and I mean, it's Chelsea. Uh, of course, our league form is, is decent, but it's impossible to to beat Manchester United as they've already won the league but we still need to make sure we secure that top four finish and we get back into the Champions League we will be doing one more season with this save so let's make sure this the final season uh, goes into uh, something good into a Champions League campaign you know uh, side note as well uh, my new series, which is Thames, which I sort of trailered, is now going to come out in the new year, at, at the start of the new year, not the first, but near the start of the new year, um, and Arsenal will become the secondary save that we do, sort of, if we ever do two uploads, this will be sort of the secondary upload. Uh, final thing, another series is actually happening right now that you might want to watch, FIFA related, I'll talk about it at the end. Right, there we are, all the admins out of the way. So, things are going well in the league. We're looking decent in the cup as well. So, let's hopefully now win this game in the Europa League and progress forward to the promised land, which I've often thought is the semi-finals of the Europa League. Let's get it. So, team-wise for this one, uh, Robert Green isn't registered, so he can't play. Danny Rose is suspended. Alex Awobi is injured. Uh, and this is the team that we're going to go with then. Czech will be in goal. Bellerin and Kurzawa on either side. Van Dijk, Kishelny, Xhaka and Arthur in the centre. We've got Meros on the right. Hazard on the left. Ozil, Dembele. And uh, this is what we're going to go with. Dembele is a man in four. So let's stick with him and see if he can carry on. I don't remember what happened last time he played. This is the first time I've played the save for about two weeks. But hopefully we can get, you know, the end of this season could bring me back to a, a new life. And then from that point onwards, we can progress even further. You'll notice the green screens here, by the way. Not on. Don't let that put you off. It'll be used for something soon. New Year. I've mentioned it a few times. Okay, then. The games are set to get underway. And uh, the referee just stood very isolated there. It looks like we might be talking about him. Uh, but the games do start then. Espanyol have got a team. We should have probably looked to see what it was. So they're playing the 4-3-3 formation. Okay, we hold obviously that one goal lead uh, as things stand. It's 3-2 on aggregate, and now we're away from home. So Espanyol got themselves a couple of away goals. That definitely went out of play. The referee's on the ball there. Well done to you. Arthur, lovely. It's still, I, I mean, it's been a while, and I'm still getting that wrong. It, that was Bertha. And this is scary, which is a different TV show entirely. As they drive forward, we get a little bit fortunate, and Czech makes, he made a lot of that, in my opinion. But we hold the lead, knowing that away goals will be pivotal to progression in the competition. Costa off on that side and um, there's a temptation of course we play a very attacking tactic if you recall and um, there's a temptation to play on the counter attack we'll do that from now shall we as at this stage we're going out welcome back Ben thank you very much football manager it was their first shot on target but well some things don't change as hazard free kick though 30 yards out I mean I mean uh, it, they cleared it um Right then. Right, time is uh, is steadily going away here. And we do really need a goal. That's that's quite important. Two goals, obviously, puts us level with what they got at our gaff. They look, they look very tired, comparably to us. They look knackered as uh, Bellerin goes for a little jog. But he's, uh, he's scythed down. And now Mazet Ozil plays it into Arthur, who lays it forward to Bellerin, who's up on his feet now. As uh, Dembele out to Hazard on that side. I mean, how dangerous he can be as he hits the byline, chips it back. Dembele, well, mm, I'm going to need more from him. Dortmund are beating Spal. Which is a shame. Right, highlight. Final highlight, I suspect, of the half. And, uh, well, there's a lot of hope here that it will go our way. Xhaka thought about it for some time. And now the ball moves forward. Arthur over towards Dembele, who slide challenges it. Mares, it's in the back of the net. Unbelievable scenes. Um, unmoved. The paramedic, the, the assistant, don't care. The fans were in the goal, devastated. And uh, we, we equalise. It's 1-1. Xhaka thought about that for so long. Put it into Ozil, who, uh, who sh shifted it to Xhaka, who's left-footed ball through the middle. I mean, it's easy, isn't it? Dembele goes two-footed in for the challenge. The keeper's beaten. And Mares slots it into an empty net. And there we are then. Right then. Well, there we are. 4-3. Looking 
Okay. We just need to make sure this continues. They are they are dead on their feet out there. Bellerin's struggling for us, but we've got Chambers or Holding that we can bring on if needs be. And um, yeah, this second half, pedal to the metal, boys. Although as someone that doesn't drive, pedal to the metal... I've, I've never put pedal to the metal. And then she talked about the arcades, where they'd have those car things, and I thought I was super sick on them, uh, knowing that I couldn't drive in real life. So didn't really affect anything. Although back in the day, I was a demon on a go kart. Let me. I was like, I was like, I was like Mario, Mario Kart. They used to call me. They didn't. They, I've never been called that. Why would they call me Mario Kart? That was the game, Ben. Hazard free kick. Football's happening. Uh, he's, he's hit it from distance. Oh my goodness gracious! It's not gone in, but it was a good effort. So at this point, we're still on the counter attack. We hold the lead. The question is, do we make a change? Bellerin at the back is a, is a little concern as I told him to get too tired. Or bring Chambers on as he can play that role pretty well. To be fair, uh, Lacazette's going to come on for Dembele. He's on a 6.5. All he's really done so far is slide tackle. And while slide tackle is a feature of football, it's not the main reason he's on the pitch. But a chance for us here then. What's going to occur? Xhaka's got it in this deeper role. Chambers now, of course, on the pitch. Right, roaming forward. Mares. If we can pull it back, we could be in here. Right, Riyad Mahrez. But he's been hounded there. Unbelievable. Uh, Van Dijk knocked it down, though. And we come again. Arthur. Lovely ball out to Chambers. How good is the delivery into Mahrez? If we can pull it back, he can! And Mazzel's there to make it 2-1 in this game. 5-3 now on our Get, and that semi-final place is a kid all but certain. I mean, the, the keeper's picked it out of the back of the net. He's devastated. Xhaka into Arthur. Arthur's played a, a lovely few, a few through balls in this game so far. And that is another one. Into Mares, whose pullback is, is selective. And there's Ozil with the, with the goal. And I think everyone to calm down. Which I find, when you do that to away fans, only makes things worse. But there we are. Ten minutes to go. Changes have been made. Of course, do we make one final change? Or do we now just... Hope that nothing goes wrong. As uh, they obviously need to get through. Like, if they score two now, it goes for extra time. So we've got quite a nice cushion. As uh, Perez plays it forward though. And, well, that's not being given, has it? That's not being given. Tell me that's not being given. Referee? Isn't it? It's not going to count. Foul on Petr Cech. And I, I agree with that. Could have been harrowing, couldn't it? If that had just found its way in. I mean, five seconds to go. It looks as if the semi-finals are upon us. I'm very fascinated to see who we get in this, actually. There's some decent teams left in the competition, and I guess we'll wait to see that, though. But 2-1, looking very good. You've got stats over there for days. I think the tiredness factor probably made it... Uh, well, they didn't allow Espanyol to get back into the game. They were too tired. There was no way they were going to fight back, and uh, we've made that look easy, if I'm, if I'm honest. Well done, ours, everyone. Well done, ours. All right, there we are, then. Uh, Mario shines. We get a little bit of money as well. We'll let our assistant do the team talk, and I want to see who we get. The draw for which is... Uh, it's coming up now. We then play Chelsea in that battle for the top four, which is going to be a big one. So it's Dortmund, Sevilla and Leverkusen. Wow, all pretty good sides. Uh, two German boys in there. Hopefully they meet each other. They do not, but we get by Leverkusen. We'll take a little look at them. How good are they these days? 2019... I suspect they're probably quite good. They've got a hot prospect here who's more hot than a prospect. And uh, yeah, Julian Brandt, though, well worth looking at. He's a very good player. Someone I thought about buying at one point, actually. Uh, Leno's there, of course, as well. Very good goalkeeper. Again, another player we considered buying. And, uh, and Lars Bender. Ironically enough, another player I, I thought about buying, but went for Seri instead at the time. Um, so a decent side, not to be messed with. I guess we'll see how we get on. Anyway, on to the Chelsea game, and now that's coming up for you right now. Okay, welcome back. I promised you the game against Chelsea, and here it is. So, let's take a look at what we're working with. We're going to stick with the exact same team as we just played in that cup game. I do think it's probably our strongest eleven, and it also allows us to have a really strong bench. Wilshire, Perisic, Seri, Lacazette, players like Danny Rose and Gay, not even getting on the bench these days. So, we'll, we'll see how we get on. Uh, also, James Vaughan doesn't feature on the bench today. Will that come out to haunt me, I wonder? I hope not. But you can see lots of goals being scored by that front four and Lacazette as well. 27 goals. You think about the amount of goals that front five, if you want, if you like, are scoring. It's an awful lot. And obviously has got nine as well. So when he features, he gets amongst the goals too. So let's see how we get on then. Chelsea are a good side. Recently been knocked out of the FA Cup by Manchester City though, worth saying. So let's see. Who have they got? They've got Morata. They've got Memphis, who's there obviously to replace Eden Hazard. William on one side. Kante, Fabregas. David Luiz playing in that slightly further forward position which, you know, fair enough. I think people quite like to see him there. Uh, Jordi Alba, of course, is there as well. Laporte, Rudiger, Azpilicueta and Courtois. So not too many changes in the Chelsea team since, apart from, like, the, like the, really, the sale of, uh, of Hazard is the big one. And we were at fault for that. I say fault. Like, we did pay money. Right, I've said we owe Chelsea after last time. Uh, and here we are then. 
I wouldn't say it's an accurate representation of the Emirates, although it's not miles away. Okay, the games are underway. Then we can beat a Spanish side away from home. Can we beat a rival, a London rival, of course, a City rival uh, at home? Now, first highlight goes Chelsea's right. played to Morata on that right-hand side. He drills it across. It's cleared by Koscielny. Decent clearance, but David Luiz will pick it up. Captain in the side today, which is curious. It's Bellerin. That's a lovely little challenge. Another one, maybe. On the ball he goes and is driving forward. Look at the pace of Bellerin. Over towards the side. It was no slouch either. Edin Hazard mm. Captain Eden I think when I said Captain Eden there I meant Agent Eden as if he's working for them Captain Eden makes him sound like a pirate Aye, it, was a, it, was a, it was a project we had it was the Agent project I don't know where he's from <laughs> Hobie Hartes. Memphis now, they're on that side for Chelsea. And they're working this quite nicely. Morata, he's got the attention of a few of our players. And uh, Chelsea so far, stretching us more than we'd like. But Kurzweil nips in there. And Urza with a great first time ball over to Hazard. He's got Dembele in the centre if he can find him. Hazard pulls it back. And there's Dembele. Left-footed finish. Lovely goal. Seven minutes gone. And the home fans are celebrating wildly. I love how... Is that code? Is that written? Something? Is that something wrote there? Written there? Something there? I don't know what's there. I just like the fact that in that, that section there, they've all bought white t-shirts and gone, yeah, let's all wear the white t-shirts today. But anyway, Hazard puts it back. Easy finish. Courtois kind of there. And we look good. And this is a huge win. If we get this, we get a five-point gap from Chelsea. And uh, the top four is a good all but certain. I don't want to have to rely on winning the Europa League. That's too much of a risk. All right, it's another highlight for us, actually. Not long after their goal, or sorry, our first goal. Ozil's on it now. Ball whipped back across. Mahrez is there. Headed over. 10 minutes gone, Chelsea are going to build from the back. And I'm intrigued to see what they do here, whether our high press wins it back, and it does. Dembele over towards the side. He was so in the game at the moment. God, oh, hell, oh, the, the, the held he had there, the hold. The held he had there was unbelievable. Well held. See, I knew it would work eventually. Well hold. No, incorrect. I'd be quite happy with not many highlights, but it's another one. Half an hour gone, and uh, we're playing it around, hopefully, the centre. Arthur and Ozil sort of combining. Arthur plays a 1-2 against the face of N'Golo Kante, which I think we can all get behind. Does there Bellerin now? Works his way forward. Mahrez, he's got runners. If he can find them, he goes alone, though. We had Mahrez, my word. That would have been something quite special, wouldn't it? But um, it wasn't special. It was poor. I've got to say, this has been very highlight-filled so far. As the ball's played through, Van Dijk looks like he's going to deal with this. Pacek's there as well. Koscielny. We're just so, ca we're so cash. Ozil forward towards Dembele with a little bit of hold-up play into Riyad Mahrez who's got to score and he does. I mean, it's a great control and a great shot. Courtois decides, right, I've got this. Oh God, I've not got this. If we just watch Courtois on the replay, he looks confident and then immediately feels like he's not as confident. Lovely ball from Ozil, by the way, into the feet of Dembele. Instant control and that's not a bad ball either. Courtois just sort of doesn't even try to dive. And then looks down like, oh, no, I'm so sorry, everyone. Yeah, use your arms, you fool. I should be giving him advice. He's, I'm against him. Not politically. I just mean in this particular... No one even mentioned politically, Ben. Y you've brought up politically. I don't know what Courtois believes politically. <sighs> Maybe I'll tweet him after this. See what he's see what he's thinking. Right, the halftime team talk so far has gone... Um, well, it's mixed, by which I mean one person cared, uh, which is good. Kurzweil is loving life. Everyone else is just like, can we just go back out there, please? Because like this, uh, this, if anything, this talk now is a distraction. I often wonder if they'd be doing better if there was just no manager. But um, hmm, I wonder. I did tweet a picture out of this, but I'm going to mention it here as Mahrez gets injured. That, 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 I just want to clarify, this wasn't it. This wasn't the thing I was going to mention. Uh, Lacazette's going to come on as a winger, which seems... To, actually, no, Ramdoy to attack. Let's get it. But no, I, uh, I've got a, st a stream save going on where I've managed loads of different clubs. Currently West Brom, but Arsene Wenger in 2023 has just retired and he's won the Carabao Cup in that time period since the game began. Unbelievable. He was getting decent league finishes, and I think he was even runner-up in a Champions League final, but a Carabao Cup. That's all they won in six years. Love it. Dembele, saved. So I've saved Arsenal, if anything. I've come along here, and hang on, what have I won so far? I've won the FA Cup and the Carabao Cup. So really, me and Arsene Wenger, not that dissimilar. Although previous to that, like, he was winning all sorts. A lot of it was ten years ago. Lacazette's ball in. That, that, this surely isn't going to result in a goal. Courtois with a save. Was he not offside? <laughs> That Mahrez injury is a bit of a concern, to be fair. If he's... Uh, <laughs> Zonzi's bits up and not for them. I think they brought in Zonzi on and then he's got injured. They might even be down to 10 at this point. I'm not sure. Anyway, the point I was going to make was that uh, that Mahrez injury could be a real hit to our campaign. Obviously, he's, he's played really well for us this year. Awobi's already out, remember. So, I'm not sure what we're going to do. As again, Courtois saves. We've been we've had a lot of chances. Six clear-cut chances in this game. Six! Arthur, ball in. Dembele, Lacazette. It's, bo it's bubbling all over the place. It's like Boris Johnson in a cabinet meeting. I hope Courtois didn't mind that comment. We're forward again. There's about five, well, about five minutes of normal time. I mean, Arthur's wasting time, if anything. 
This is a good display, though. We'll be five points clear of Chelsea. We'll have played 35, three to go. It's going to be very difficult. We'll play Stoke next to a 19th. It's going to be very difficult to knock us off our, our, our top four perch. And there we are then. Game over. Really good couple of wins. And it's nice to be back, folks, I have to say. If you're pleased I'm back, do leave a like. If you're not pleased I'm back, maybe refresh, watch again, remember what I'm like, and then leave your opinion um, but no if you want to see some more subscribe to the channel of course and uh, that's going to bring us to the end then we're in love with care and it's been until next time goodbye if anyone did send me a message by the way a nice message of, of support or not I do appreciate it uh, if you felt like I ignored you it was just it wasn't that it was just I didn't know what to say really so thank you for the support and I'll see you tomorrow with more of this. And I did mention at the very start of the video, uh, I'm doing a FIFA Road to Glory on the second channel. Um, I will leave a link in the description to that if you're interested. There's already five episodes, so enjoy yourself. Actually, by the time this comes out, six.